Yes. Uh, sir, for this particular person, all these predictions or you means it has been made very well. Now, is it possible that with these conditions, uh, the astrologer could uh, give uh, a suggestion or an advice to avoid, uh, uh, I mean, such a bad reputation to such a good person? Mm -hmm. Not avoid, but minimize. Okay. You cannot avoid what is inevitable, mm -hmm. but you can minimize it. So he would yet have a bad reputation even then? May not. Okay. See, how I tell you, yeah. this man went and submitted this document. What he should have done is, he should have consulted an astrologer okay. who would have given him the proper day, muhutpa, when he should submit it. Yeah. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you. It's excellent. Thank you. Then, the consequences would be modified because of the strength of the energy of the planets on that day. Or oh, when he gives the paper. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. So it will be minimized. Yeah. So it's also the fact that there are some very huge issues there in yeah. the chart. chart. But then what is just casual remedy is not good not enough. Yeah. Yeah. You've got to have some guru advice or proper uh, yeah. use of yes. it. So yeah. do it at the right moment. The moment will help you. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Anybody else? Any questions? Okay, it's professors here anyway. He said he is, you can always talk with him. Yeah, I don't tell you. Yeah. Anytime, anywhere, sitting in the dining room, lounge, except when I'm sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> the so, computer is always on. You can ask any question, I will tell you. Okay. So, anyway, we are now um, meeting. Um, after lunch, Keiko is giving me some message, so I'll just yeah, if give it. Um, anyone still has to pay for transport, uh, please come to me. Yeah, please. Thank you. please pay for the transport. Uh, Keiko is collecting that. And uh, what I was going to say is that some things happen automatically in a conference that are not planned at all. So one of the things is that the um, sixth, eighth, and twelfth houses are being <laughs> emphasized. <laughs> <laughs> so the inevitability of karma, which we as astrologers have a third eye in the sense that we can minimize it. And uh, so it is segues into Keiko's workshop after lunch, which is on 6th, 8th, it's just 6th house, okay. But oh. it's very uh, illustrative uh, yeah. Yeah. of what Professor said. Yes, so just the 6th house, but she's also going to talk about the Shatripu and the remedies as well. So uh, we are looking forward to it. And uh, uh, and the other aspect was the wealth, you know. A lot of workshops came up out of wealth. So anyway, Nick, um, uh, so we'll have a nice break and see you all at 2 p.m. Thank you very much.